rocket? We're almost there. I have not seen him emerge. Hang on. I'll call him. Hey, Rocket? We need you up here. I think you can handle a freaking temple without me. I guess he doesn't want to talk. Well, Rocket is in no shape to guard Nebula. Someone's got to stay back and keep an eye on her. I will stay behind to guard the prisoner. Um, hang on. No, you won't. I am not leaving him here with her. You heard him before. He wants to rip her apart. I did say that. She's my sister, Drax. Does this mean you're volunteering, Gamora? Yes. I'll guard her. No! You cannot be seriously considering this. You're the one who told me to reconnect with her. Now that she's here, I deserve that opportunity. And I'll make sure she stays out of trouble. Nebula is my responsibility. Your record on that matter is questionable. Gamora, you should stay behind and keep an eye on Nebula. Maybe it'll give you a chance to talk. Thank you, Peter. You... You side with her again, Peter Quill. Perhaps I truly have no purpose. Let us return to the temple. I will be ready when you are. I am Groot. Find me in the temple. Let's go find out who's waiting for us. I, uh, I forgot how slow this elevator was. I do not like being back in this wretched place. Well, this ain't a field trip, Drax. The markings on the forge said, find me in the temple. So, here we are. In a temple. Again. Hello? Anyone here? Yes, I am here. As is Groot. But I should be guarding Nebula on the ship. We've been over this, Drax. So, why don't we just spread out? Okay, look for secret doors or passages or whatever. I've got my scanner. If anyone's here, we'll find them. Hey, Gamora. How's it going with Nebula? About as well as I expected. She's been pretty quiet so far. Well, that's... good, I guess. Better than the alternative. Oh, crap. What was she doing here? Star-Lord! It's Hala! Oh, my God! Oh, God. Why? I saved you. That was a hologram, you big dope! Look! Where did they go? They went up. Well, these footprints are fresh. Hey, Groot. You think I chose the right person to guard Nebula, right? I am Groot. Right. Thanks, pal. Last time we were all in this room, you really kicked some Thanos ass. Thanks for that. I am Groot. Yeah, I feel you, buddy. 
Have you seen anyone around who seems like they might know what an Eternity Forge is? I am Groot. Oh, something over there I should look at? Well, thanks, Groot. Keep up the good work. Quill, I apologize for my outburst on the ship. However, I should have been the one to guard the cyborg instead of Gamora. Gamora has too much of an attachment to her sister. She might let her feelings get in the way. Gamora needs this time with Nebula. They have a lot to talk about. Mm, perhaps. But I still do not trust the cyborg. She has much wickedness in her circuitry. Hey. You're not still upset about me choosing Gamora to guard Nebula, are you? You have explained your reasons to me, and I will accept that. That is enough. Okay, good. I think. Let's not forget why we're here. Have you found anyone yet? No, but I have seen fresh footprints in the dust. Yeah, I've seen them too. Let me know if you notice anything else. It's weird being back in this place again. Kind of gives me the creeps. This place. I cannot help but think of my family and how the vengeance I strived after. It ended in this room. Let's get back to it. Hey, how's it going up there? Not now, Pete. Come on, Rocket. Okay. This is gonna sound like I'm hanging up, cause I'm hanging up. Man, Thanos really packed a punch. <laughs> I still can't believe we all survived that fight. I am Groot. Looks like Thanos' armor. Didn't exactly protect him. Good. It is a comfort to know the Mad Titan was mortal after all. Looks like some kind of button. Okay, so much for that. They're pushing them at the same time. Button on this one. Didn't work. Both must need to be pressed at the same time. Just checking in. Anything new to report? Nebula is finally talking to me. That's new. Thanks for giving us this opportunity. Absolutely. Hey, Drax, you see that statue? Press the button on his helmet when I say so, okay? You okay? Okay. One, two, three. What happened? You went early. No, I didn't. One, two, three, go. I was waiting for the go. Oh, fine. One, two, three, go. And it's Christmas.
Check this out. That definitely looks like the Eternity Forge. And those souls are being absorbed by it. That's why it didn't work for Rocket. It wasn't charged. Hey, Gamora. How's it going with Nebula? About as well as I expected. She's been pretty quiet so far. Well, that's... good, I guess. Better than the alternative. This actually mean anything to you? Hmm. No, but I like the skeletons. Well, this is where Thanos found the Eternity Forge. Look at this. Looks familiar. And here is where Hala failed. No Eternity Forge, no prize. Here goes nothing. Whoa. What does it say? Hang on. Let's see if Nebula's Cypher was worth all the trouble. The Eternity Forge resides here, pending such time as it can be wielded responsibly. Until then, she shall remain entombed across the galaxy. Huh. So, this is not the correct temple? We came here for nothing. Hang on a second, there's more. It says... Emnios? The temple we're looking for is on a place called Emnios. The symbols are a star man. <laughs> I know how to get there. Gamora. Peter. Whoever we're looking for isn't here, but we figured out where to find him. Get those engines fired up. We're going for a ride. Um, about that. Rocket's down in the engine room. He's uh, yelling some new and creative curse words. Yeah, you might want to talk to him. Look, I know you miss Lila. That's okay. <laughs> I don't... I don't... <laughs> Deep breaths, Rocket, okay? <laughs> Trust me. It'll help. Just in, out. She's gone. She was the only thing keeping me alive. And I couldn't save her. She protected me. And I couldn't, I couldn't help her. You loved her, didn't you? Yeah. I did. I never told her, though. I thought I had time. I thought if I could just get her out of there, if she could just see it. This is all I have left of her. This stupid computer. 
I can't do this without it, Pete. I thought I could, but I can't. I can't. She's always going to be with you, Rocket. You haven't lost her. But it's gone. I can't fix it this time. There's nothing left. I, I still can't. I don't want to give her up. That's all I got. You should hold on to it, Rocket. It means a lot to you. <laughs> What's going on? Get the Eternity Forge, keep it safe. Go help Rocket. What are you gonna do? Right. There's no air in space. Oops. Wait! Let me fight. You trapped me on this piece of junk and now we're surrounded by pissed off Kree. I don't want to die here and neither do you. If you keep me here, they'll kill you, your friends, and then they'll come for me too. Let me out. Without me, you're just gonna get us all killed. It's your only option. Okay, but one move against my crew. Any of them gets hurt, and this little trust exercise is over. Do you understand? I understand. Nebula wouldn't pass up the chance to fight. Well, someone on this ship has to keep you all alive. Here! This one's yours. times, isn't it? <sighs> Never gets any easier. Ah! We've got to move. Now! <sighs> Couldn't have said it better myself. And that is the engine room. Rocket! Nebula and I will keep the bridge secure. Just get the power back on. I am Groot. Right. Engine room. Mm. 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 
Rocket! Ha! Ah! <sighs> You think you could possibly win against the Kree? Now that I've obtained the Eternity Forge for Hala. Ah, oh, stop, dude. Just... Just stop. I really don't care. How dare you speak to me like that? How dare I? <laughs> you come onto my ship, you bust up my team, and then you go about spouting your evil plan like a bad monster movie? Hold your tongue! Hala will... Oh, Hala can kiss my beautiful Earth ass! Mm. Hey, guy! What's it like being on fire? Ah! That bad, huh? <laughs> Stupid. You must think you're clever, Peter Quill, but you can't run forever. The forge will be mine. Do not be foolish. I don't know. I run pretty fast. I think I'll take my chances. I've given you many. And you have wasted each one. <sighs> Peter, you better get the engines running. The Revenant's weapons are coming online. Rocket, I'm on it. Gamora, set a course for Emneos. Drop off our stowaways on the way there. Mom is down there. No. I, uh... Whatever's down there, it isn't her. But we need to find out what it is. With the forge, maybe there's still a chance. So, if you can bring her back, what then? You still going to be doing this? Guardians? Well, come on, I wouldn't do that to you guys. The Guardians stick together, no matter what. Well, you two will be sharing a room then. Unless she'd prefer bunking by the engines. This is it. So, what now? I'm sure Peter has a plan. You do have a plan, right? I know what I'm doing, guys. Trust me. Can't argue with that.
It just never stopped. We were at each other's throats over it. I am Groot. I am Groot. I am Groot! You ever play that game, Monkey in the Middle? No? Well, here's the thing. There's a bunch of jerks. They stand in a circle. They toss a ball around. And some poor turd in the middle tries to catch the ball. That turd, that's the monkey. And I... <laughs> man. I was that turd. But Quill is... I mean, let's face it, he's kind of the worst person in the whole galaxy. I started thinking about leaving again. Oh, yeah. I threaten that all the time. But this time, I meant it. I don't think I was really prepared for what we found on Emios. Oh, Peter was definitely not prepared. At all. You don't look surprised. Oh, after Ray Jack, I didn't see him again for a long time. Any of them. Worried? Hell, I've never been happier in my life. Quill, all of them, they fell into a dark hole. Real dark. Real, real dark. All that ancient stuff we found, guess what? It wasn't meant to be found. Honestly, why didn't they just bury it? You know, why'd they leave all these clues and crap? Just hide it better. So dumb. I mean, Hala, I mean, she might have. Who knows? Then again, maybe she would have stopped if it wasn't for us. I felt like Nebula was coming around. I don't know. Certainly she was just as angry as she always was. For a little while, I thought it could be just like it was before. Before Tarval. Real, real. Real dark. Real, 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 real. And when we finally found her, I... I couldn't make sense of it. None of us could. And what she showed us... Oh, yeah, the second it was out of her mouth, I knew. I mean, you get a chance like that. So much power in your hands. What would you do if you had to make that same choice? No one should ever have that much power. Ever. Everybody looking at you? thing about responsibility it sucks like a lot real 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 dark dark man you know still fun though